वेलकम टू नाइटिंगल व्यू दिस वीडियो इज अबाउट द क्लिनिकल थर्मोमीटर द बिगिनर्स और द न्यू लर्नर्स कैन लर्न अबाउट वॉट इज क्लिनिकल थर्मोमीटर वॉट आर द पार्ट्स ऑफ अ क्लिनिकल थर्मोमीटर एंड वॉट इज द फंक्शन ऑफ क्लिनिकल थर्मोमीटर सो दिस इज कॉल्ड क्लिनिकल थर्मोमीटर अदरवाइज कॉल्ड ग्लास थर्मोमीटर सो दिस इज अ मर्क्री बल्ब सो दिस मर्क्री बेस्ड ग्लास थर्मोमीटर और क्लिनिकल थर्मोमीटर इज फर्स्टली डिवाइज और इन्वेंटेड बाय गैब्रियल फैरन हीट इन द ईयर 1714 एंड इन इज नेम ओनली वी आर मेशरिंग द स्केल इन अ डिग्री फैरन हीट देन इन द ईयर 1942 अनदर साइंटिस्ट नेमली कॉल्ड एंडर्स सेल्शियस ही डिवाइज द मेशरमेंट स्केल बेस्ड ऑन द सेंटीग्रेड और अदरवाइज कॉल्ड सेल्शियस so this are all the two measurement scale nowadays we are using in the clinical thermometer now we are going to see about the parts of a clinical thermometer or otherwise called glass thermometer normally this glass thermometer has two main parts one is bulb this mercury tip is called bulb and this is a stem bulb is made up of a mercury because mercury is one of the metal which is in the liquid form at the room temperature so based on the body temperature the liquid may melt the mercury may uh, melt and it will be flowing inside the mercury column okay so these are all the two main parts one is a bulb another one is a stem and in the stem if you see inside there is a yellow tubing so this inside this tube you have a mercury column then you have a scale either in the degree celsius or in the degree fahrenheit so what is the least temperature in the thermometer means in fahrenheit it is 94 and in celsius it is 35 and what is the highest score in the fahrenheit is 108 degree fahrenheit then 42 degree celsius and in the mercury column inside if you see there is an yellow color mercury column and after 108 also there is an column that is called expansion chamber whenever the temperature exceeds more than 108 this will maintain the pressure inside the glass tube so these are all the parts of a clinical thermometer and one more thing between the bulb and the stem there will be a kink so this is called kink or the neck constriction we used to say why there is a neck constriction means whenever you are taking this thermometer from the site of oral or axilla the mercury column will not fall down so that's why this neck constriction is been placed here so the mercury column will not fall down when there is a constriction between the bulb and the stem so this is about the clinical thermometer if this video is useful for you please do like comment and share don't forget to subscribe this channel thank you